Hello and welcome to another edition of the Everlast Power Video Series. In today's edition, we'll begin to take a look at the 2015 model PowerTIC 255 EXT. After over a year on the market now, the 255 EXT has proven itself a hardworking and reliable TIG welder. However, as good as it is, we weren't content to leave well enough alone. As a result, the 2015 version introduces several key feature improvements and changes. Key feature additions for the 2015 model year include improved power factor correction for reduced amperage draw and improved operation on generator power sources. An efficient four fan design which not only improves cooling and efficiency but also reduces noise levels by up to 10 decibels. The unit now has a purge feature for adjusting gas flow without having to step on the foot pedal. This year's model features a spot weld timer which is perfect for tacking and making consistently sized spot welds. This year's model offers improved operation in stick mode with the addition of a 6010 cellulose function that improves arc performance. One of the most notable improvements is the addition of the dual voltage operating capability. This will allow you to operate the welder on 120 or 240 volt single phase power for maximum go anywhere portability. Please note this unit no longer supports 1 and 3 phase 240 volt input in favor of the dual voltage capability. For those wishing for dual phase capability on 240 volts with options up to 480 volts 3 phase, the new 325EXT now supports the single and three phase operation with 325 amps output on single phase. Let's do a side by side visual comparison of the features between last year's model and the 2015 new design. Beginning with the lower front panel, the negative and positive ports have swapped locations. The newer 2015 model negative port has been conveniently relocated to the left side next to the gas connector, as opposed to the older model's right hand location. When comparing the 2015 model with the previous model, several changes in the top panel are evident. Even though much of the basic design and existing functions have not changed, several controls and functions have been relocated and a few have been added as well. The select button has been moved from the bottom to the middle left hand side for more intuitive use with the related functions that it controls. A purge function has been added in its former location to allow the user to purge the lines and set the gas flow without having to cycle the torch switch or step on the foot pedal. To the right of the parameter adjustment control, a special spot weld timer feature has been added. With this function, the user will be able to make perfectly timed spot welds, improving penetration and consistency of tack welds in sheet metal spot welds. An additional light has been added to the TIG weld cycle graphic on the panel so that the spot weld parameters can be set using the select button. Note, not all controls will be usable with the spot weld timer and will only work with the 2T or pedal 2T function. The adjustable parameters of the stick weld function have been moved to just above the TIG welding cycle graph. This is designed to work more intuitively with the select button. In the former location of these functions, we've added an additional feature for stick mode. This function is designed to improve the performance with 6010, 6011, and other cellulose electrodes. Note that some brands of electrodes may be preferable over others when using this function. This year's model features a standard NEMA 650 power plug for 240 volt operation and a 120 volt adapter plug as well. Join us for part two in this series of the 2015 PowerTIG 255 EXT when we take a closer look at the unit and discuss the latest accessory package. Thanks for joining us for this edition of the Everlast Power Video Series. If you have any questions about the PowerTIG 255 EXT or any of our other product line of welders and plasma cutters, give us a call at the number listed below.